Shabazz Sharif is the country's new prime minister for the second time. Allies of imprisoned former Premier Imran Khan in Parliament shouted in protest against his appointment on Sunday, alleging rigging in last month's election. Following days of negotiations, Sharif's Pakistan Muslim League party and his supporters formed an alliance after the February 8th election, which was overshadowed by militant violence, a nationwide mobile phone shutdown, Khan's exclusion from the vote, and an unusual delay in announcing the results. Authorities said the communication shutdown was necessary to avoid attacks on candidates and security forces. Heavy rains across Pakistan have left at least 36 people dead and 50 others injured. So far, 30 rain-related deaths have been reported in Khyber Pakhtunkhwa province bordering Afghanistan since Thursday night. Officials say five people died in southwestern Baluchistan province after floods swamped the coastal town of Gwadar, both forcing authorities to use boats to evacuate people. Casualties and damage were also reported in Pakistan-administered Kashmir. The National Disaster Management Authority says it's sending emergency relief and heavy machinery to remove debris blocking highways. Joe Ramsey, VOA News.